Yes. Hello, my name is Yan. Today I read the Bible. The Bible title is this. Onava was a great uh, Onava meet God. I read Nava was a great army commander in Syria. He was brave soldier. But he had terrible skin disease. Collis repulsive. Naaman's Israel servant girl said, Go see the prophet Elisha in Israel. He can heal you. Naaman took many gifts with him. He took the king's letter to the king of Israel. He reached Elisha home to his carpet. Alicia sent out a man with a message. Wash yourself seven times in the Jordan. You will be healed. At first, Naaman was mad to Alicia. He thought it was a silly thing to do. Elisha doesn't even come out to see me. He doesn't even pray for me in the name of God. He doesn't even touch me. Jordan is only the one river. Only river. Naaman was mad. He and he tried to go back home. On his way home, the servant told him, Please go to Jordan. This is not a hard thing to do. Just your wash yourself. Now man went to Jordan as Elisha said, he washed himself seven times. Naaman's skin became clean like that a child. He, his skin disease was gone. Naaman was very happy. Naaman can begin to Elisha. He tried to give Elisha gift. Elisha didn't accept the gift. Elisha told him to serve God. Naaman was healed. He did what Elisha said. Elisha told him about God. Now I read this story. Joshua repaired the temple. King George loved God. He he did want God please. He walked to people do what God please. He want his people come to God's temple often. God's temple was not good shape. The people didn't take good care of temple. I have only repaired the house of God. The king Joshua made up his mind to repay it. I need money to do it. Make a big box to collect offering to put inside in the temple. The King Joshua command. People was happy. Here, yeah, help repair the temple. They brought the fourteen. When the 
box was for king servant to open out and put the box box back king george collect or lost money to repair the temple the king george killed King George gave our money to the worker. He heard Muslim carpenter. He heard worker for metal work. They work very hard. They repeat the temple very well. The the they repeat the temple of God according to its original design. They made king for God's temple with a rest of money. The temple became worship place. The temple became happy place. Now I read this story. Nineveh was servant Persia king. One day, Nehemiah heard some sad news at the place. The wall of Jerusalem broken down. The gates of Jerusalem were burning. Nehemiah cried a server every day. He prayed without eating anything. The king asked Ninue, hey, Are you sad? Ninue answered, The temple of God country is burning. The gates of the city are burning with fire. The king asked Ninue, The king was worried. He asked Ninue, What do you want me to do for you? Ninue answered, Send me home. Please allow me to rebuild the world. You may go. Rebuild the world with whatever you want, said the king. The king, Nineveh, block, built the world. He took block and returned home. Nineveh was helper. They began to rebuild the world. Some people didn't want to rebuild the wall. Some and Tori were very angry to the idea. They laughed at the people of Israel. They turned it hard in way. They tried to try to hurt the helper of Nineveh. They didn't want to rebuild the world. The God had Nineveh rebuild the world. God had Nineveh put off the gates of the city. Nineveh did what God wanted him to do. It was easy to rebuild. It was not easy to rebuild the world. They rebuilt all with God's help. Their friends and for Nineveh war. They thank God to help Nineveh. They thank God to make Nineveh rebuild the world. This time we read the brave King Esther. Today we read we be building a new world. And more story. Yes, today we read the Bible with a fun and a fun. Yes, I think I'm enjoyed. Yes, see you next time. Bye. See you next time.